Just up here guys, I was out here yesterday um, filming reference that um, video I made of the sheep at sunset and the peewee magpie lark. But anyway, it's coming out here yesterday guys and it was a, I, what I thought was a dead bobtail lizard in the middle of the road and I passed a car so this guy accidentally or deliberately ran it over. But anyway, just coming out the rubbish dump then, I just noticed that the bobtail must have been still alive. It might still be alive right now, I doubt it. But you can see where it's actually... I'll get out and I'll show you. See where it's actually crawled from the middle of the road to die on the side of the road. So the bobtail lizard was right here, guys. Right in the middle, right here, in the middle of the road. So the worst thing about this, guys, and I come across this all the time with dead snakes, bobtail lizards, uh, a lot of reptiles, like even carpet snakes. I did a video on a, a year or two ago, but it looked like someone had deliberately ran over thinking it was a poison snake when it's actually a beautiful, um, carp harmless carpet snake. But you can just see the track here where it's crawled across the road to be injured. This is what really breaks my heart, guys. Yep, he's dead. So, people deliberately run, run these over, guys, these beautiful bobtail lizards. It really breaks my heart, you know. Honestly, I'm joking, guys, there's some awful, cruel people out there. They do it for the fun of it, showing off in front of their friends, or um, thinking that it might be dangerous. So I don't know what goes through people's minds, guys, but this is just a... The example, the bobtail was in the middle of the road, so I'm presuming that the person driving up should have been on that side of the road and in the middle, and he might have. I'm not saying he did. He could have deliberately run over. But people do do it, guys. That's why I did a video on a carpet snake a year or two ago, and like someone had deliberately, deliberately ran it over. It was injured. I tried to rescue it, but it ended up dying a few days later. So anyway, guys... It's awful, cruel people out there. Just wanted to make this video, it really breaks my heart. See you guys. So anyway guys, might as well let nature take its course. The other day I found this beautiful uh, big red uh, soldier bull ant's nest. So what I'm gonna do is go drop this off at the, put it on top of the bull ant's nest and we'll see how long it takes the bull ants to completely strip it to the bone.